No, Laura, you're not getting it. If I make a list of 10 factors that impact the health of Americans, ingredients is going to be number 10. Over 90% of Americans don't meet fiber or vegetable intake guidelines. 80% of Americans don't meet physical activity guidelines and Americans aren't even walking. They're over consuming calories, they're over consuming sugar, they're eating too much calorie dense nutrient poor food and not enough nutrient dense food and they're not moving their bodies. Starting there would have far more impact on health than switching out a preservative or a color additive in a highly processed nutrient poor food. Addressing healthcare access, economic stability, equitable food access and food insecurity because nearly 14% of U.S. households experience food insecurity where they don't always have access to the foods to meet their nutrient and energy needs. And that includes one in five U.S. children who don't always have access to the nutrients that they require. And yet you've been misled to believe that food additives are the problem by a party who routinely has voted against policies that could actually help the health of Americans. And by wellness influencers who are taking advantage of the food additive narrative to sell you a high priced alternative and make a lot of money off the deception while you stay outraged at number 10 on the list and continue to stay unaware of the actual factors and policies that are affecting the health of Americans. So again, you're not getting it and you're being misled by people who do not actually care about solving the health issues in this country.